That's a theme, bruh. Whoo! What the hell were we doing? So this is a level 21 just now? Was it pointing to me? It was. Wow. If I put it on me, it points to the main scenario. Oh. The road so far. So we continue with the adventure. Oh, you missed my solo. <laughs> I mean, you missed nothing. You didn't miss anything. Hi, Claire. how it's done. Didn't miss a damn thing. <laughs> Never 
I gotta work on my defense game more. <laughs> Fiends roam this place. Pressure an enemy. Rare variant identified. Commencing guidance protocol. As their size puts them at the lower end of the food chain, they're exceptionally skittish creatures. In addition, they can actively regulate. To my ears, bro. Music to my ears. Second, got a party invite super damn early. The only voice I want to hear right now, well, next to Maddie's. <laughs> Bro, I have to turn off speech. I can stand here and chat with God. Oh my God, this is so much better. Is it holding triangle and making spot for other people? Oh, right, they weren't kidding. Your Why does he talk all throughout the fight? Bro, it's the girl that talks throughout the fight, and then he talks before the fight, he talks after the fight. I'm so sick of hearing these two, bro. And I look it up online, a lot of people feel the same way. It's very fucking annoying. Because you're trying to focus on that, and next thing you know, you got them shrilling at you. And then you can't move when he personally calls you. It's like, why? Okay, we, we need to hit that truck a little slop soon enough. I am fucked up. <laughs> Where's the spring? I don't know. Truck will stop first. Cause, yeah. but, uh, we can heal with items. See what I got on hand. Got ten high potions. a little bit early for me to die, but I just didn't know what else to do, so I just jumped up. Nope. Not like I have anything to do. I don't have a fucking job, but still. You do have a job. Well, apparently, uh, having a girlfriend isn't one of them. Oof. Well, why'd you burn yourself like that? You know, I still care and love her, but at the same time, I'm tired of her manipulations, and the last thing she did was the last straw. Yeah. 700 HP and MP. Hmm. Let me make another one of those. Let me make another one of these. God, oh, man. You know, you think with all the shit I've been collecting, like, endlessly, you'd think I'd have plenty of ingredients, right? <laughs> no. <laughs> 
I mean, I think the same thing in Warframe, but apparently I'm uh, missing out on shit. I'm like, how the hell is that possible? Yeah, there we go. We make some cushions. So if we do need to go to the jungle bus stop, we can. What the hell's over here? Oh, you know what? I think this is the area for the next boss fight, which would be pretty shitty. Because <laughs> we can't fight in water. Don't fall for it. So we need to get here for the next Fiend Intel. Divine Intel, the last one is here. Wait. Oh shit, I don't think we can get this man. Oh no. Cause I because I when I went here they said the area was on lockdown. Let's see. There's an owl there. Probably want to direct me to the spring. Is this spring that way? No. Why is there an owl there? Who knows? The last tower is over here. Interesting. Hold on. What's you get like here? a summon if you beat all the towers? You got a summon if you talk to Chadley yeah. and <laughs> do the summon battle. If I do the divine thing here, it'll make the summon battle much more easier and the summon material will be much more stronger when we beat it. Oh, Jesus Christ, Zero Bahamut. <laughs> oh yeah, they named him something else. Uh, shit, where's my book? Hang on. Because I was like, I was like, oh, that's a different name. Uh, here it is. Here it is. Here's the box. Uh, here you. Let's see, uh, art book for the enemies. Right here. Okay. Actually, it'd be summons on enemies. Oops. Is that a table of contents and made this easier for me? There's a lot of fucking pages. It does not. <laughs> cool. Oh, wait, wait, yes, it does. Section 2 is a summon. Section 3 is enemies. Well, what the fuck is Section 2? Oh, my crease. Housing, sir. It's always housing. Uh, here we go. Okay. Kajada's in this? Oh, I wish I didn't see that. <laughs> Who? Kajada. Who the fuck is the, that? Uh, remember the big bull, but then like a tetra attack of lightning, fire, and ice. <laughs> in uh, the original Final Fantasy game. I think the wild Marlboros are still the worst enemies. No, it's a summon, though. Oh. Uh, there's Alexander, not me. Phoenix. Yeah, Phoenix is what we're getting now in Junon. Uh, mean, here it can is. Can we get your Jimbo? Oh no, this is actually Neo Bahamut, but they named him Bahamut Arisen. So I don't know what they call Zero. Zero might be in the third game. Yeah. I like Neo Bahamut more than Bahamut Arisen. They shouldn't have changed that. That sounded so much more dope. What, what a metal fucking name that is. Neo Bahamut. <laughs> hey, Yojimbo's been in almost every game, I feel. Yojimbo. No, not Yojimbo. I know who you're thinking of. You're thinking of Gilgamesh. Nope. The samurai you pay? Is he? Hmm. By the way, Gilgamesh is in this game. <laughs> when I when I collected a relic, I saw a vision, and there was him looking forward to meeting me. And apparently he's in Wutai. Okay, Yojimbo hasn't been in every game. He's been in 5, 6, 10, 10, 2... 14, 15, Tactics, Dimensions, Fantasy, Jesus Christ, there's so many Final Fantasy games. Yeah, this is the blocked one. We can't go through it yet. Ah, uh, we're going to have to make a little bit of story progress. Hmm. Hmm. I'm sorry, I'm a... I think I mentioned this before, I'm a completionist whore. I like to do everything before I move on. That's right. So, this kind of bothers me. 
Now, how do we get to this wellspring? Better question. The burb. It was over here. Yeah, he's right there. The burb only directs you, if you don't mind. <laughs> the burb only directs you to wellsprings. The spring is there. The burb is there. What's going on here? Is there a way to... Is there a wellspring there? That was a divine thing. Huh. Well, I'm a little fucking confused, bird. I, I can see it's here. Alright, let's see what's up with that. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, that's not the owl. That's a bird enemy. That's what that is. Okay. <laughs> Better chug a book and run up a fucking wall? Yes, I can. Not only a specific wall, though. Yeah, yes, sir, sir. Yes, sir. Spider choke. Spider so, choke. According to what the ranch tells you, about every region has a different type of chocobo. So that got me thinking. That got me thinking the one in Cosmo Canyon is the one that flies. So then I'm guessing the gold chocobo will just be able to do everything. But then which region has the gold one? Oh, that was in a fucking volcano, or if you can crossbreed it enough. Right. But there is no crossbreed here, it's just depending on region. So, I will assume the one in Coral is the one that can cross over the sands. Uh, love a 1980s workout socks on your chocobo. Oh shit, I didn't even notice that! <laughs> hey, you shut up. <laughs> That chocobo's got style, you son of a bitch. Okay, there's the wall. There we go. There's the owl. Right, the owl of this region is black, not red. That's what fucked me up. Not gonna lie, this is pretty fucking cool, though. <laughs> The, the one stand on this game is Chadley. Chadley and his uh, female <laughs> version of my... The biggest stand well, in this game. Maybe Chadley was supposed to be Chatley, but they didn't want to make it too obvious. <laughs> well, he is an AI slash cyborg. Let us partake with the planet's wisdom. You know what? They should have just called him Claptrap. Ah, uh, Claptrap I can tolerate. <laughs> I see a few Rongos saying about, oh, he's the best thing they added to the to the game. I'm like, you fucking dumb. <laughs> Final boss is actually Chatley. <laughs> oh, I hope so. Let me kill him. <laughs> but the gameplay loop, like this and all that, I don't mind this. I don't mind this little bit of it. No, it's scanning. I'm scanning the wellspring or life spring, whatever. <laughs> Sorry, I just had fucking Warframe flashbacks there. Yeah, it does feel a little bit life servicey. Nope, 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 don't you talk to me. Leave me alone. <laughs> Leave me alone. Wait, we found it? Huh? Get, get the fuck. The screen. Yep, that's the boss right there. Oh, he was right in the middle there. So it doesn't become active until you do enough scans. Hold on a second. Why is it saying I completed combat assignments, but clearly I haven't? What are you talking about here? Oh, I see. They say that's enough data I need to find the boss. Got it. I need to do 9 and 9 to find him. But yeah, I haven't done all yet. So what's this thing here? Excavation intel? Do you know how far you can get on the second disc, or...? No, the, the two discs are for installation. The, the first disc installs uh, data that you need, and the second disc is what you play the game with. Okay, Call of Duty. <laughs> Pretty much. Do you know how far they're gonna let you go on this story, then? Pretty damn far, considering... Wutai is going to be a place to go to. <laughs> Actually, I wonder if they let you get up to the weapons. That's a good question. I I think it will go as far as the reunion. 
Probably Does that field of weapons were at the end of disc 2 on the original? No, it was not. The end of disc 2 is when you defeated... What's his name? Hojo. That was yeah, because after you beat Hojo, the weapons come alive. No. <laughs> Don't they? No. Uh, at the beginning of disc 2, when you go up to the North Crater and Cloud Hounds over the Black Material to Sephiroth, that's what unleashes weapons along the planet. And then Cloud's missing from the party for a while. You're playing as Tifa, Baron, and the rest of them. And the first weapon. Yeah, because he's gotten lost his fucking mind. Right. The first weapon comes and attacks Junon. The, and then um, uh, Ultima weapon is just flying all over the place, fucking up cities. <laughs> has that weapon, already happened, or is that. We haven't gotten to that part yet. We haven't gotten to that yet. Okay. We, we, not in this game, no. I will I'm be just... looking forward for that fucking. <laughs> So I don't know how, how far this goes, but considering the content that they're gonna save up, we do know you go as far as Cosmo Canyon, and we do know that Sid's gonna be playable, and Wutai is available. So I'm I thinking like... this game ends where Disc 1 ends, <laughs> probably. At the City of the Ancients? I feel like it will end there, yeah. Oh, cool, we get the cool cutscene. <laughs> I mean, we already saw Aerith died. Nothing happens bad, but then no, if this is the true edition, then that might not even be a possibility if she dies or not. That we don't know. Uh, we're gonna get in some remake spoilers, but because they originally said that Aerith was gonna get have a, you can have a choice whether to save her or not at that time. Yeah. So when it came to remake, Aerith's bond with the planet was so strong a remake. She actually knew things would happen in timelines. So she knew that there was going to be a chance for Cloud to try and save her. And she was throughout giving her the, sorry, giving him these lessons, but he should just move on, just do what he needs to do. And then when it came to uh, Rebirth, that's this game, the, that connection Aerith had is gone. She, she still has a connection, but it's not as strong as it was. So uh, Tifa asked her if she knew anything about Cloud's past back then. She said, I just have a feeling you might know something I don't. And she's like, I did it sometime, but for some reason, I don't anymore. So she lost that connection, though. Yeah. They had to buff or uh, nerf the MacGuffin. The, the reason for that is, and I, I think Zack answered that for us at the beginning of the game. Because in Zack's timeline, when he went for Aerith, she was dead. So I'm guessing... This is the only era that's around and throughout all the timelines right now. That's why she lost the connection, because there's no other era to connect with. Ah. The infinite universe has been dwindled. Indeed. So let's see. We don't want to go here yet. Absolutely don't want to touch with this yet. So let's go... What level do I need to be for that? 26. <laughs> okay, let's let's take off this thing first. Let's see what this is. I'm very curious about that. Oh, I know what that is. Um, that's to get transmuted chips for... For making more shit in my transmutation thing. Yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna pet the burb. Good boy. I'm still waiting for the uh, the option to hug my bird. I want to hug and feed the bird. I want this to be like a Red Dead Redemption 2 situation. I hate to say it, but that's the standard now for open world games. Pet up more? <laughs> yeah, there should be like different pet animations too. <laughs> I'm sorry, Square Enix. I, 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 I hate to give you the busy work, but you already opened that door. Now walk through it. Now, make a modification of Planet's Favor. Oh shit! You can just make it now? Dude, that's so good. That's so good. 
Now we can put those extra little things to work. And I can't move. Charlie's gonna call me again, isn't he? I still can't move. Charlie, if you call me, I swear to Christ. Thank you. Okay. I said that one person that really wants to be a fucking friend. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> what, are, what are you doing tonight? Oh, that sounds fun. Can I join? <laughs> You're nothing. Wait a minute. If I leap off the chocobo, I can stay in the air calm. But wait, that's what you're saying. Fucking dead. Are <laughs> <laughs> you going dead? <laughs> Fucking dead. <laughs> okay, that was nice to learn. Where's my bird? Hi, bird. <laughs> Last night, those fucking fly fixed is a problem. Now that I know how to launch cloud in the air, not so much a problem anymore. You have like wind materia? Apparently, he does blade beam on the, on the fly when you do a dodge. But if you dodge and hold attack, he launches himself right in the fucking ear. <laughs> Some soldier jeans, boy! Soldier jeans. Soldier jeans. Or maybe it's just Zach's pants, I don't know, it's hard to tell. Zach's <laughs> pants. But technically, these are. Actually, not even technically, these really are in Zach's clothes. Oh, Christ, don't you talk to me, please. Please, please, please. I see you made it safe and uh, uh, The proto relic should be nearby. I like I didn't how he calls remember. Him. I didn't Go think ahead. Cloud was exposed to Mako. I thought he was just stealing Zack's identity, and that's why he said he was a soldier. No, he was. But a no, he was a clone from Sephiroth too. No, didn't it? That was a lie. They do to fuck with his head. He was a enlistment in soldier in the program, but he never was given that Mako treatment. Until uh, the Deep Behind incident. That's when Hojo started fucking up with him. That's when he was infused with Mako. That was his first dose of being Mako poison. That's what screwed up his whole fucking identity crisis. Okay, something's up. This looks simple. It's right there to grab. However, let me go here. Let me move this. It says a proto relic is a four stage thing. Four scenarios to collect the proto relic, but I'm seeing it right in front of my eyes. Hey, is this something? Unless there's four proto relics to collect? Maybe? You torture him for me? Please. Used to study basic tactics with it. Game's pretty fun actually. Wedge was into it and Liar. would play sometimes. Liar. Wait, Don't! <laughs> four complete the four condor battle. I don't believe it. Oh, that sounds terrible. I don't believe it. We're saved! What in tarnation? What 
Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> that is so cool! I love how they're freaking out about that. <laughs> I'm so happy! They look just like their original selves. Shut Barrett. No! I'm thinking that that's how you get Phoenix though. Shinra forces are poor. It was how you got Phoenix. Yes. Help us! You're our only hope. We are? We are. Now what did I just say? There's no time! The enemy's already upon us. We'll explain on the way. Just come! I was not expecting this. <laughs> This is so cool. Oh my god, they're units. <laughs> it's so great. You have been sucked into the board game known as Fort Condor. To claim the proto relic here, you will need to lead the Condor cavalry to victory over the advancing Shinra forces. Your forces are composed of two types of he units heroes and ally units. Press to change your hero units and adjust your overall strategy which will alter the types of deployable ally units. When you are satisfied with your battle formation, press, press start to begin the skirmish. Hang on now, why Tifa got the lowest HP here? What's going on? <laughs> no, I think we need Barret, because, yeah. What? Why are you leaving the black man? Hold on, something's wrong here. What are these symbols? That means range. And that means defense, probably? Because there's a shield? I feel like y'all left some shit out here. <laughs> oh, you can see info. A very powerful defense unit with a large amount of HP. Perfect for the front lines. His braver skill deals devastating damage and applies barrier to nearby all ally units. Ooh. Barrett. A ranged unit able to attack frontline units from the rear. His focus shot de skill deals devastating damage and heals nearby ally units. So what does Tifa do? A quick footed, a powerful she vampire She jumps up and down unit. and distracts everyone. Pretty much. <laughs> Her dive kick skill deals devastating damage and applies haste to nearby ally units. That could be good. Uh, spew fireballs over a wide area when enemies approach. This flings piercing pinions at approaching enemies, losing this unit but not affect your chances of victory. You lose the match if this unit falls to headquarters one. Huh. Okay. Yeah, let's try it out. <laughs> to deploy a unit, use the cursor to select a location in the bottle. Press X. Uh, here you will enter tactical mode where you can choose a unit. Take note of your opponent's deployment strategy. Located on the right side of the screen, I'm playing a quarter Okay, so all units assign one of these three roles: vanguard, range, or defense. Pay close attention up to these roles as they determine what enemies a uh, unit will be affected against. You can view a diagram illustrating the relationship between the three roles in the top right corner of the screen. What, you mean the one you're blocking? Oh wait, they can see it now. <laughs> okay. So range beats defense. Defense beats vanguard. Vanguard beats range. Alright. <coughs> Each unit also has an ATB cost. The stronger the unit, the more ATBs acquired to the deployment. Alright, so I have four ATB. I can bring in one vanguard. One, uh, one ranger. But I think I should bring in a forcer kind of region. Hold on, let's see what they deploy first. I don't trust that shit. They bring in two range. Now they bring in two 
there, 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 there. Right there. Okay. The shield beats that, so we'll put a range right here. Oh! That's not what I meant to do. <laughs> I've said ranger, I'm an enforcer. I'm an idiot. I understand. Alright, there he goes. There he goes, I'm about to die. There's a ranger there. So let's put in. Doesn't really have a string here. I guess it's just for healing. So in that case, we need to put the cleric here. No, let's put another enforcer here. God damn! <laughs> I'm gonna get fucked up. Nice one. Right. We can bring in something big. And now I'll clear it. Why are you healing the other one? It's fine. Oh shit. <laughs> Need a ranger here. They lost one thing. What's up, Law? I'm in Deviri. Deploying units of the same role as a hero unit will fill the hero's deployment gauge. Once this gauge is full, you will need you will be able to place your character on the field. Nova these units can only be deployed once per skirmish. Super. What you up to? When a hero unit is placed on the field, that? we will unleash devastating attack while we damage enemies and buff allies. <laughs> hey, what are they going to rework on him? I meant to bring in the enforcer. The stakes are made. I just hope they never rework Avara. Like, no one uses her navigator really, but that's always the skill that I take off and put on something else. Okay, that was actually fun. I think I did a silence build with her, because that way you just go cloak and do backstabs on everyone. Uh, for a moment. 
Let's hide. Audio. There we go. We did it! Victory is Victory ours. ours! And we owe it all to your gracious aid. We thank you. Is that fucking Gilgamesh? Hello, troopers! It would seem that our next battle is fast approaching! The enemy could launch another attack at any moment. Please, you must stay and help us fight! Not again. Hold up! The Proto Relic! Hmm? What is that I spy? What is that I spy? My memory is failing me, but intuition tells me that is the treasure I seek. Hold! Unhand that, you rogues! Captain! The hell was that? Uh, call me crazy, but we were inside the game, weren't we? That's impossible. It is impossible, Ray. Level four, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. Ooh, that's exactly what we gotta go to next. Right. Well, that was freaking interesting. Ah, oh, my eyes! Isn't Fort Condor kind of a big deal in Midgard? Yeah, it was really popular in Sector 7. Maybe I should have gotten into it earlier. Think I could still learn the basics? I don't see why not. I bet both you and Red could pick it up quickly. What do you say to that? I accept any and all challengers. Oh, someone sounds confident. No backing out, okay? Listen to y'all. As if we've got nothing better to do. <laughs> My eyes. How come my bird can't jump down this thing? Hi, oh, I'm nobody. You're here? Yes, you are. <laughs> That's a bit sore. Ah. Okay, let's see. We got ground bird and flying bird. Oh, 
like you. Thought I dodged it. Got burr problems? Call Baron. Damn right. Yes. He's, he's the actual black guy who can get away with being armed. I mean, black is a good color. Can you get some red of it? <laughs> Pink and green. What the, am I watermelon? How <laughs> dare I? I forgot what the frickin' Google place was here. I saw when I was up in the mountains. Wait. I know I heard him. Lead the way, my son. Well, since you brought it up. <laughs> Five Google medals. Hot damn! Let's see if it's on PS Plus. It is challenging. So have fun. Yep, have fun. I got up about to say. Doesn't look like somebody talking my arrow off every five minutes like another person I know in another game. Here he is. Here he is. As soon as I fucking said it, bro. Shut up. Wait a minute, did you say Mind Flayer? Some Mind Flayers of Final Fantasy? What are you talking about? No? When? I'm doing it. I don't, I don't remember this. <laughs> Let's see. Mind Flayer. I have no memories. Oh my god, there it is. 
That's not a my flare. That's just some. That's some. That's a my flare at home. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the one I'm looking at right now, at twelve, holding a staff and wearing his grandma's robes and shit. What is this? <laughs> yes, I have. I finished it. I have no memory of that. I have no memory. Wait, you said the Zodiac one? Huh. Oh you yeah yeah, it says the Zodiac versions, that's why I never that's why I never see it this week. Okay. It says right here, uh, Zodiac versions only. Alright, are we good? No, we're not. Barrett's at half HP. Let's make some shit. something else. <laughs> what are you listening for? What's in your wallet? <laughs> Alright, we got some good stuff to put on here. Is it worth negative eight defense for this? Negative eight. <laughs> what did you what are you airing for? What are you here for, sir? <laughs> I'm gonna get this one. Okay. Now let's see. First strike material. Did I level up my fire and ice? It still ain't there? Oh, this takes forever. So that's the catch. That's for catch. Okay. Look at this. The healing material is almost gonna be a level three. <laughs> my brain's not working. Huh? Queen's Guard Bamboo. I just realized the catch here. Ah, oh, I didn't see it. The slots don't connect, so my, my support material won't work here. Shit. 
That's the catch. So we gotta switch it back. So he said. I believe you. It's just the way it sounded. It was funny to me. I'm sorry. All right, let's do this. Wait! I didn't heal yet. Shit! <laughs> healing shits. Now that's a mind player. Damn. I'm afraid you have never Mind player detected in the bitch. Landing synergy abilities for pressure. <laughs> the game does not pause <laughs> when your controller dies. Did not do that. Yeah, yeah, I, I, beat it, I beat it a while ago. I just got fucked up by the Mind Flayer. Ho-ho! Oh. No, I said this is a Mind Flayer. This is a Mind Flayer.
Okay, so the only two people that could do synergy abilities is Barrett and Red in this team. So I, for all intents and purposes, don't switch a cloud unless we need to assess them, which I still need to do, I believe. Unless, did I get my intel? I don't need them to level, but I do need them to level materia. That's some weird shit. Oh, um, no. I need I need to assess them again. That sucks. Uh, that's not how it worked, bro. No, the original, it wasn't by using it. It was just by having it. And then through each battle, you get experience for that materia. And through here, it's the same as well. It has to be on the person or in your party for the material to level up. But everybody levels up equally. Okay. Let's do this again. So I gotta focus. This is energy shit. As much as possible. You're a real That range was stupid. Fuck the chest of Take over. I got this. Down the dog to a move? Yes, they can. Get it down to the dog. Shit, I was close. <laughs> Real close, Brad almost got fucked up. <laughs> Yeah. 
Now we can do it. Done and dusted, folks. Let's go. I don't, I don't care, Charlie. Shut up. I had fun. Don't ruin it. <laughs> I don't care. As a certain donkey once said, let's do that again. <laughs> oh, we could, bro. That was, uh, <laughs> oh, crack, yeah. No. It ain't, my, it ain't my first time killing a mind player, and it won't be the last. Proto Relic Energy Signature confirmed near the board game. I think we can safely say that's the entry point. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get in there and crack some more Shinra skulls. Um, before we do this, are we sure we can get back? Based on the analysis of your previous trip, I am confident you'll return following the conclusion of the match. Failing that, you may be assured that I will retrieve you myself. Alright, let's do this. I don't think I'll ever get used to this. It's not so bad. Oh? He's doing the squats. <laughs> How could this be? Captain! Troopers, you're just in time. Come, friends! Let us join forces to lay waste to those beans and reclaim my treasure! What do you mean, your treasure? It came from our world. It belongs to us. Oh, cease your whinging, man. We've no time for it. Right now, we can but charge! Your mission is to help us break through the enemy lines and retrieve the artifact they stole. With the captain's aggressive approach, I fear we'll surely fail. Please, we can't succeed without you. Oh! <laughs> captain! We're coming! That's our cue. Alright. Let's bring Barrett this time. Uh... Oh, I see. That's how it works. Ballista. Powerful static melee unit, but strikes enemies directly in front of it with piercing blows. What the ballista? Okay, this might screw us over. Let's go for it. The two attack units coming this side. The vanguard helps with that. So let's do this guy and this guy. And they got a range coming in soon. I like just no one here. <laughs> and I have a defensive guy go here. Alright, I see a range person. I don't know what I'm making yet. There we go. Wait, not yet? It's part three. Jesus. 
Nicely done. Coming this way. So we need a range person. We don't have one yet. Oh my god. That way it's insane. They're just pushing their way in, Jesus Christ. Oh, motherfucking dragon, bro. What are we talking about here? Parents already dead. Jesus Lord. Oh no. How many more of those units? Why? I thought it were unlimited. I was wrong. seconds. Oh, this sucks. 23 seconds. Come on, man. Just kill the main base. Y'all almost got, got it. Come on. There we go. Woo! Captain, we yeah. won! Indeed. Yet we shan't rest till my prize is mine once more. Now, charge! I don't think about it. Gilgamesh was not a Final Fantasy VII. Oh. <laughs> you fool. Hey. No, no. That's not true. You started on the Final Fantasy V. That's where Battle for the Bridge Cream started. Yeah. Welcome back to reality, everyone. Oh, it seems you've returned empty handed. Sorry, Kate. And four and eight. I wish I could have done more, but there was so much interference. We're dealing with a powerful energy source. Powerful enough to call current models into question. Hey, Chadley, do you know anything about that? Sadly. I don't know, we missed on all that important conversation Chadley was gonna, was gonna throw at us. Oh, oh, geez. Oh, no, we'll never know. Oh. Looks like we can't finish where you spin. Not until they let us through that area. Uh, this is gone. Boogle Hotel. The Boogle House is right fucking there? Okay, let's go. Three, two, one. Here we are. Claire, where are you? There you are.
That's why I couldn't see it. Hey, we have a foot of mountain. Everybody said with the boogers of this game are creepy because of their teeth. <laughs> I wasn't really paying attention to the teeth because they said it now. Please like, why did you ruin this for me? for me, Koopo? Five boogers. Look at the boogum. So if I have them go towards that wind thing, it stuns them and I can just capture them. That makes it easier. Oh shit, that one throwing bombs. <laughs> oh my god. This little weasel. You little fucking weasel, you throw a bomb at me one my goddamn time. I was joking, don't throw more bombs. There we go, he's stunned. Got him. Come here, little shit. This is a Kodak moment right here, you know? <laughs> Actually, now that, I, now that I zoom in, it looks creepy. <laughs> it's because of Cloud's face. Cloud made it worse. <laughs> Let's do this. There we go. No, no matter how I take it, this looks weird. <laughs> no matter what angle I choose, it just looks weird. Who fucking got Hadoukens? Sonic Booms, what's going on here? Ah, I got your friend. I was supposed to catch up full when he's on the ocean. Oh, he flies back. Okay. Oh, he's stunned! Damn it. Fucking bastard. Come on. Come on, go ahead. There we go, she's stunned. Run, 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 run. Got you. You're mine now. Thanks so much. Yeah, boy. I really can't thank you enough for bringing all the Mooglets back. It's such a relief the Emporium that Mog and Mag built together won't have to close See, down. I can't see the teeth You're here, so I don't see the problem. What? Intelligence Specialist. Gabba World Intel at 50 separate locations. Nice. Welcome, Koopo! Now what you got for sale? Hey, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, something to help me level up everybody. Well, not everybody, but certain people. Let's see. Precision defense focus material airings. What? Hmm. 
Earrings which incorporate an orb of precision defense focused material into the design, allowing the wearer to avail themselves of its magic. What is this wild shit? Your accessory could be a material? Allows the use of the highest level of precision defense focus material, rendering enemies binding attacks ineffective against perfectly timed blocks. Yep. Yep. I am. Every time I try to play something, it stutters to, to fucking death. But if I download something, it works super fast. <laughs> Stutter, 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 stutter. <laughs> I can't. Like, I can't even get 10 seconds of it to work. It's fucking garbage. Okay, since we can't complete the world until, we should go ahead and continue story. Single moms. Also, I was trying to figure out what, what's going on here. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh, oh. All, all the rest of my stuff are right through this door. Let me in. Don't be a bastard. This here's the crow's nest. Base of operations for our anti Shinra activities. Sorry, but we're keeping things locked down after the trouble in under Juno. Uh, punk. Alright, so we can't. Can't complete that fight. Not yet. So we're going to go and do a main story. That's how I feel. All of the yay, sir. Wait, if I go to the ranch, I can just rest for free. Yeah, let's do that. I should also check my folios. It's been a while. Oh. Something for sale in the store. Don't need it. Whoa. Spell bomb blast. Hold the button to give up your strength for the team of your partner to unleash a charge attack. Also receive MP from your chosen partner. Cool. Heat wave. Release your fire magic without having to expend a MP. Increase march of defense by 35. Hell freaking yeah, I'll, I'll take that, but let's check what else is here. Increase tempest damage by 5%. Increases magic attack by 20%. Oh no, by 20. Shit. 20% would be great. Oh, I this? What does he pop them in this world? I don't even know. <coughs> uh, 
Yeah, I'm gonna go for that for 85. There's the mix. And let's go for Spell Wall Blast. Got one more thing we can get. Have to get this to get that trash. Why am I getting more defense ship and offense ship for Tifa? What is this wild BS? Mm, do this. Why, why are you so snoozing? Sorry, but I'm prepping my party. Oh, you hate your body? Oh. Why you were booing me? <laughs> oh, oh. Never? Oh. Huh. That's that's interesting. Red has a iron defense skill, but he can only use it with Tifa and Aerith. Interesting. So he feels very safe with ladies. Interesting. I see you, Red. I see you. You call me a liar? Okay, I see how it is. <laughs> Princess of Vengeance gains charge rate by successfully blocking. Ooh. This is an MP by three. Yeah, I'll take that. I think he had wind current. Um, Snow Flurry cost ten. Jesus. Oh, let's get wind current. But now I'm down by five because I did that. Shit. Oh well. Get something later. Barato. What do you got? Avalanche two step. Did he just smack Tifa down hand first? Let me see that again. Oh no no, I see. He grabbed her by the arm and she do it did a kick. Okay. I thought he threw a whole fucking face down. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I want it. Fire. Here we are finally to perform a ranged scatter shot attack. Nice. Scatter shot. I don't want focus or cloud. I want to do like a fucking charge attack cloud. Where did I get that? Uh, increases HP recovery by 10% when we're receiving healing. Hell yeah. No flurry. That costs five. Get it. Counterfire. Oh, that's sick. That's sick as hell. Alright. Now we did that. Uh, let's see. Good. They messenger stuff. Awesome. 
So let's equip Baron with his Gatling gun. He gets less attack? Hmm. I don't like... I don't like how the high caliber rifle right, right looks for. Well. Hmm. I love this one. Yeah, that's attack. Wow. Why is, why is all the OG equipment more magic focus? Weird. There, let's go here with the. Bro, why is my Discord blowing up? What the fuck's going on here? Oh, someone opened a new channel, and everybody just blowing that the hell up. Got it. Alright. Uh... Mute. Christmas. Eric can have two abilities? What's up with that bullshit? What's going on here? Why why she get two weapon abilities? What is this bullshit? <laughs> Yeah, thanks for reminding me. I need to find out how you level up a limit break. Uh, right. But I hear they said there was a different way to do it. Like I didn't pay attention to it. Uh, let's see this. Manual battles, limit breaks. Let's see. Taking damage and stagger enemies fills your limit gauge. Uh huh. I know that, but how do you make it stronger? Because I have cross slash, but at one point I had ascension. Oh, wait, there's a part two. There it is! Raising limit levels. Certain synergy abilities can raise a character's limit level, which will in turn unlock a more powerful limit break attack. For example, clock can perform cloud slash on limit one and ascension on level two. You can also unlock level three limit breaks if you. Uh, Limit break, ah, limit break attacks for your character's folios. Huh. So now, which synergy attack does what? <laughs> uh, let's go here. Maybe just tell us. It's this room. Okay, so Firework Blade increases the limit level. Got you. And Red was ever a naked cat dog thing. What does Relentless Rush do? Uh, effect on Staggered Foe. Attack boost. Attack power boost and Staggered Time extension. Ooh. So I gotta remember not only do these look cool, they have purpose. So me and Aerith can do limit level decrease. Tief and I are good against Staggered. Alright. So what about Badit? Brad of the Dog. Right, this is a refocus thing. Yeah, I don't like the refocus shit. I might tax that back. That seems like a waste ability. Avalanche two step. All right. So attacking at Steigert. So any team attack anybody does with Tifa does this. Got it. All right. 
red and cloud. Limit level increase. Alright. So by that logic, I should have co uh, red and air for my team. <laughs> what does Overfang do? Limit, limit, limit increase. Okay, so Overfang gets for that. Baron and... Yeah, Baron and uh, Red also have to refocus. So I think we should take off refocus. I don't fucking need it. I don't want to waste all my charges on this thing, right? I'm just gonna remember, just go for the attacks. Right, right, right. <clears throat> How does the weapon level up? Uh, world intel, in the field, traveling, battles, equipment. There we go. Weapons. When equipped, weapons boost attack, blah blah blah. Oh my god, I missed a hit the fucking thing. Where is it? Where is it? I missed a hit the button. Upgrading weapons. There we go. Adjust your weapon skills via up upgraded menu. Raising your character's weapon levels will unlock more of these skills, as well as stat boosts, allowing you to customize your party to suit your playstyle. Changing a character's weapon will not reset this level. Uh, toggle the auto upgrade function to automatically allocate weapon skills as you acquire them. Three settings are available prioritize offense, prioritize defense, and strike back, blah blah blah. I didn't tell me shit. Is this it? Manuscripts provide characters with extra skill points. Is that all they're for? I don't understand how Aerith's own can hold two weapon abilities. That's what I'm trying to figure out here. Is this it here? New weapons can be obtained for treasure chests or purchase of vendors. Be sure to explore thoroughly and check shelves frequently. Use a weapon ability repeatedly to become proficient with it. Yeah, I did that. Meeting a weapon's abilities proficient bonus requirements will allow you to learn it more quickly. These requirements are displayed under Ability Info when you select a weapon on the Materia and Equipment menu. What was it about? I don't think it was. I think you're lying. We learn all about this. I think he's lying about the manuscript. I think when we picked up the scripture volume two, that's what gave Aerith the ability to use a second weapon ability. But it doesn't tell you this. Hmm. I think you're lying. Oh, wait. Oh, I get it. I get it. She... She had enough to go over this. Okay. So, we all need an SP of 70 to get the second slot for weapons. There we go. But how did she get there before any of us? because I picked up the book. Oh. Oh. The book sent her over. Okay. So we need to get a book for everybody else. Or just keep doing missions and stuff. Okay. Mystery solved. That was nowhere in the fucking manual, by the way. <laughs> Useless ass manual. Teach you what you already know. Won't teach you what you need to know. <laughs> Gotta be fucking salty about it, I'm sorry. <laughs> Gonna look back at this one. Why well, I spent a whole hour looking on the menu screen? <laughs> You're attacking you flying bastards. It won't end well for me. What the hell is that? My turn. God, I can't 
can't put the freaking lighting. I got you. It's one of the elemental weakness or pressure room. Get the back. Sorry, say that again. Because every time my face here, the freaking sun was getting in my eyes. Everything is my fault. Why have we blocked this out to come with the play with this? No. Everything above us. Below is under Juno. Little more than an impoverished fishing village. <laughs> Vegas. Shinra's always gotta have someone to stop for. It's their friggin' MO. Damn, boy. I forgot to say, you can see the high one from me. Oh yeah, you can see it. Oh, there it is. High wind, high wind. Indeed. Dark skinned chick. Look out, Barrett. Welcome to Under Junon, our sunless oasis. My name is Rhonda. I'm the mayor <laughs> and sheriff around these parts. Uh, sheriff? Five hundred thousand for error? Jesus. Move, huh? That's half they a put a bounty out on us. Half a million? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, should yeah, rush sure put a bounty on us. We know when to turn a blind eye. How much you put on cloud? I gotta see that shit. Consider our lips see. <laughs> Five Sorry, but I call bullshit. <laughs> well, I don't think you would if you knew even half of what my town's been through. You don't like it? Leave. But over there, there's a quiet little inn where everyone's welcome. Any guys in black robes pass through? Not that I saw. Did see some black suits, though. Two guys and a girl. Looked pretty tough. Two guys and a girl? Well, Turks. They made a beeline right for the elevator. Now we're talking. No. You're so sleepy, but go sleep. In case it isn't obvious, upstairs is Shinra turf. And the same goes for the elevator as well. Don't ask me what, but the company's got something big planned up there. And security is tight. You know, it just occurred to me. You started. We're gonna ride the dolphin. Anything at all? And there will be consequences. 
As long as you're over 18, you should be fine. What? I thought I was playing followage. I wasn't sure what they meant. Pretty much. She said, there's got to be black robes around here somewhere. So how are we going to find them? That would depend on where they Shrugs? are headed. Why are you shrugging? If they mean to continue west, there are only two ways off this continent. By sea or by air. Right. Might want to ask around town then. Locals will know routes not on the map. May have even seen stragglers pass through. Or got boats for rent or something. How about we meet at the inn when we're done? Sounds good. And remember, low profile. New Queen's Blood players await your challenge on the Junon. Hell yeah! You don't know anymore? <laughs> I don't even know what you're referring to. <laughs> Go sleep. Oh no, it snaps. Oh, Why you have you thought to yourself? Huh? Mind if I get a shot of you? I've got the perfect backdrop. I like how Claw poses with his freaking camera. <laughs> Getting the exposure correct out here can be a bit tricky. What with the lack of sunlight? I truly appreciate the challenge. No, As I always, like watching. <laughs> I'd welcome tips about other promising Fine, spots. but keep it up and sleep to it. <laughs> Folios? Well, hope you found what you needed. I'll go through it after my night meds. All right, babe. Many years ago, this stretch of ocean was home to the Republic of Junon's capital, a floating city built atop a fleet of interconnected <laughs> ships. <laughs> You're kind of dirty, Jacob. Oil, coal, wind. Hell, oh, Thomas. Ah. Oh, those some creepy looking kids, bro. <laughs> uh huh. Then we can make them pay up when we win. Oh, hey there, Mister. Are you looking for someone to play Queen's Blood with? We'd be more than happy to go a round or two with you. I'm Devin, the younger brother. And I'm Darren, the older one. And together, we're the Double D Duo. A team of twins who love Queen's Blood. You'll face my little brother here first. If you win, then I'll take you on. Two for the price of one. Sweet the deal, water right? <laughs> the Double D Duo. If you lose against either of us, you gotta fork over three gil. Go soon after my night bitch. Alright. <laughs> no, I guess it's not a Uh, let's see. Let's take out. Let's take a magic pot because it kind of screws me over a little bit. No, take this one out. This one's screwing me. Let's put in Chocobo and Moogle. And let's take out one of the Crab Boys and put in Theo. Yeah. Put this one in. This requires two, though. Cactor is a funny one. Because I need to play it in the top left corner. To get the most out of it. Yeah, let's just try it. Girl with my defense. I play for Dark Magician Girl. Let's get rid of this. Yes. I 
I don't even pray, so. <laughs> I see, Christ, too. Hmm. Can't put that up here with the reuse of advantage. Yeah, see, when I do that, can't play anywhere else. So let's do this first. Cactor, man, I need you to show up, man. Shit! myself over here. Yep. Not a feeling. Oh, thank God. No! Oh! I gotta, I gotta restart. My trigger finger, bro. I miss a press X so freaking fast. I put the card down the wrong space. Okay, let's see. Refresh. <laughs> oh, I had such a good plan. I fucked it. Oh look, Cactor is here now. That's great. Cactor, Cactor. Okay. Good, good, good. Then you got a something of space there. That's how you play, huh? That's how you play, huh? Little bastard. This guy. Please say we can use that space. This should do it. This should lock me in. But he has two cards to play with. I should have it. Shit! He got it. Yeah, that fucked me over. Okay. Let's do this again. Restart again. We'll restart again. Uh, play. Cactor first. Part of the cards. <laughs> People should. Sure. 
there playing that top. Your mama's a whore, I want you to know that. <laughs> Hold on here. Oh, good space. Don't you play here, don't you play here. Alright! Ready to take both of those. Hell yeah! What you got? Uh huh, uh huh. That's what you got. Bro, I guess a magic pot and this is done. Actually, hold on. Oh, we could block him here! Fuck yeah! <laughs> you can't play nothing now. <laughs> oh, that was dirty. <laughs> that was absolutely filthy. And then we do this. <laughs> He's completely blocked. This is Pretty much. If we play... Wait, there's a boost here. What's that from? Oh, the crab's down here! That's why! Oh, that's cool. <laughs> he won't beat me for long. I got a double boost down here too because of Cactuar. Oh shit, he's fucked. It's done. It's done. There's Magic Pot. There we go. Seal the deal. <laughs> so fucking finished. Couldn't be more done. I'll take my winning card now. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> Clean house! <laughs> Let's say the double D duo just got double dicked. Not bad, but next, you gotta beat me. Wait! I gotta. Hold on, I gotta do two matches in a row? Yo, you some twats. Don't worry, Devin. I promise I'll avenge you! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you were venting. Let's get rid of these two for now. Yes? Yes. Such a risk. Woo! That's a risk. Let's do this first. This feels safer. Stop copying me, you bitch. <laughs> Keep moving ahead and block his plays. That was interesting. What the hell is that card he played? Play something new. Yeah, that's what I said. I hate you. We free play started. I hate you. You knew it. You knew I wanted to go over here. I hate you. Okay, no rule. You see Cactor for his play him right away. Cactor not here? Alright, play this. You 
so cute. You're so cute. You're trying to block me again. I'll get you. Fuck! What?! Alright, take care, man. Fucking bullshit. This kid played three fucking cards with a block more than half the board. What is this bullshit? My Chocobo Google card takes ages to get to my fucking hand. Where's my heart of the cards now? Where is it, Yugi? Gives you power. <laughs> Toxicity of yours. Hmm. Pretty much already won it. <laughs> Pretty much already won it. Fuck him. <laughs> Pretty much only one of it, fuck him. I'm mad and shit. You put me through a lot of fucking pain, bro. <laughs> do you love do you love how the master part didn't show up once? Done. You're a second rate dude is with a third rate deck. I'll be taking that, thank you. Aww, I can't believe we lost. You're better at this than I thought. Hold up. Does this mean we don't get our three gil? No, he totally still owes us. I'm oh, what? pretty sure the deal was if we lost, we got three gil. Isn't that right? No. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You may have beaten us this time, but we'll get that three gil from you yet. So if you're ever in the mood, come back and play. Fucking greedy poor bitches, get out of my face. Dave's Chocobo Express! No, 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 don't look at me, don't talk to me. You are not my friend. Wait, you want to buy something? Here? Okay. Yes. I like the way you say that. What's wrong? What's wrong with the things you have? Why is she phrase it like that? You want to buy something? Here? Jesus is expensive, though. No weapons. 
What's this? You got starter packs? What about the booster packs? Ooh. Ooh. 500 each. Hell yeah, I'll take them. Thank you so, so much. No, oh, thank you. Okay, let's go to my, let's go to my deck. Let's make a new one. Uh, right here. Enfeebling abilities. You now own a card that can lower of a power or enfeeble other cards. When a card's power is reduced to zero, it is destroyed, and the position it was occupying becomes empty again. Sick. I'm trying out all the new ones. How do you view it again? Uh, there we go. When played, lower the power of enemy cards on affected tiles by three. Oh, that's so, that's so sick. <laughs> I like it. Yes, that ship was used before. When played, lower the power of, uh, of allied and enemy cards on affected tiles by one. Weird. Allied and enemy, huh. I think one of those. I don't trust that shit. <laughs> and play low power of ally enemy cards that affect the tiles by three. These are risky ass cards. Huh. Why does one cost two to play? Low of power of enemy cards affect the tiles by four. Ooh. Take two of those. This looks sick too. Quits a cuddle. This card has no abilities. Looks pretty cool. Zoo. We got the zoo card. Zoo zoo zoo. We have space for two more cards since we get count. Uh, probably creates a cobble. Uh, yeah, let's get it. There we go. Can I rename my deck? I'm just going call be called deck two. Okay. Yeah, we try that deck out. See how that works. There you go. Word around town is Shinra's holding some kind of big event up top. Wonder what. Hmm. I think I have a feeling what that event is. Elevators are only way up, but Rhonda won't thank us if we storm it. Discord messages. There's a parody in Secret of Grandia of Navi where she comments on everything you see and gives tips from the beginning of the game. When you are no longer in, and another, another NPC in your party starts yelling at her, and tells her how, tells you how to murder her. It was pretty hilarious. We're recruiting for Crows Against Shinra. Well, Charlie's not hilarious. Charlie makes you want to shoot somebody. Make a better day after. Oh. Hey, Jamboree. Yep. 
Pretty sure I've snuffed out all the competition there is around here, huh? Hi, I'm You're competition. Down, Want to snuff me out? Sorry, but I was just about to leave port. Oh, name's Isabel, by the way. Was looking for a challenge, but failed miserably. Since this place was a total bust, I figured I ought to try my luck elsewhere. Although, maybe you can put up a decent fight. What do you say? One round of QB before I set sail? Put your money where your deck is. We got Shiva we beat her. Nice. I'm just serious now. <laughs> Interesting. I need to see what I did. When played, add Bandroga minion to your hand. This really is freaking Yu Gi Oh! <laughs> Play zoo, but I can't play zoo yet. What do we do here? Just block the rest of it off. Yeah. I'm only fix the back row. Mm. Quite a pickle. No matter which way I slice is a recent situation. Alright, we'll play this one. Get some ground. Oh my god! Bitch, destroyed my card! <laughs> you is a bitch. <laughs> I want you to do this, especially for me. You's a bitch. I gotta restart it. <laughs> I run out of spaces to play. Okay. Now we know how to go about this. I 
think about this good though. I'm gonna play around in the middle, ain't you? No. Oh, interesting. Hopefully this is going to get automatically destroyed. I need some of them take it. Hmm. Any cover goes as an automatic zero. That'd be a waste. This is fine. this one. <laughs> Any card of a place just gets destroyed. We could do a two for one special here. I take it with me when I play that, right? The card's gonna get destroyed. Interesting. Power of enemy cards affect the tiles by three. So I play this one again because I don't have an enemy card in front. Yep, it's locked. We got it. I'm gonna get some sleep. Good night. Have fun. I will. You have a good night's sleep. I'll be taking that card. When played, spawn diamond dust of power two, four, or six in empty positions. Damn. You took the wind right out of my sails. And here I was thinking my ship was unsinkable. Happy to be proven wrong, though. Especially by a real pro. Glad we could get that match in before I moved on. With all that pent up frustration. <laughs> I wouldn't have been able to think or sail straight. Thanks for clearing my head. I'm gonna stick around a bit longer. Just enough to swab the deck once more. Wow. Oh, but can I do the hero? Though? Game's range. Well, we already dealt with that before you all even put the job up. you 
win before Shinra came along. I don't think I ever felt like eating fish raw. Some fishing village this is. Ain't even allowed to take a rowboat out. Shinra's saying it's only a temporary prohibition. But people gotta eat. Anyway, short of stealing a boat and causing a scene, both us and our black robe friends are SOL. What does SOL mean? Oh, never heard of that. Yeah. Barrett's like, both us and those black robe friend, uh, black robe people are SOL. I'm like, SOL. <laughs> HP up, nice. And a chest. Bottle of Effa. Yeah, that's right. The reactor Juno, it's underwater. I forgot about that. That's why their freaking water so screwed up. How did they build one underwater? Only kids allowed in here. No grown ups. Yeah. Only kids allowed in here. No grown ups. That's a really good question. How did they build it? <laughs> I I need it. A... Go ahead. Probably. Real quiet today. Because they would have to have power to do that, and the power came from Mako. Special delivery coming in. There's another player here somewhere, I don't know where they're at. They're probably in that kids only area. Don't drop it now. The people here, they hate the lack of sunlight, but not me. I like it this way, though I'd never tell them that, of course. Yeah, because that'd be a pretty dick thing to say here. <laughs> Be right back, gonna grab a snack.
I'm back. So I have a question. What is what is the big deal about steamed milk? When I went for my coffee one day, this dude was very very specific about his order. He said, it must, please get steamed milk. I wanted to be with steamed milk. I'm like, what's so special about that? I never even heard of steam milk until that day. <laughs> For real. You get your milk when you fix this damn door! <laughs> Of addictions. So give it a person who won, who won uh, weed, well, <laughs> they'll just keep eating, having both. Be that Oreos. It's perfect combination. I swear. Because I'm making high potions. I need to make more planets' favor. So that's what I need to make. Let's finish it up. Nice. Throw it over beneath the booze. I need to make supernatural risk guards. What do we need for that? Exquisite beast hides. We need 10 of those. Zinc ore. Don't know where to find that. Oh, wait. Yeah, I think I know where we find this. It's gonna be coral mines, isn't it? Good riddance, I say. They stuck. Where's the coral? Our land, our lift. There's a lot of black people in this game, by the way. <laughs> Hello there. Room for one. Help! Somebody, please! Help! Am I supposed to turn for that? Or Anybody, please! Sword. You're some kind of fighter, aren't you? That yeah. was Priscilla. And from the sound of it, she needs a tough guy like you to lend a hand. Fast travel is unavailable. We gotta go! Now! There's a monster attacking the boat! Jesus, speed. This way! Down here! Quickly! Please! Hey! Hey! Somebody! Anybody! Help! I was wondering where he was gonna find you. Somebody saved that knucklehead in the intro. Oh my god. Hey, 
Sandra's most wanted. Get rid of that thing. Say what? Barrett, focus. Are you all ready? I'm afraid of attacks the little girl and do not. Do it, Claire.
god. Oh shit. Oh no, you don't. Not the dolphin assist. Oh, I forgot the assassin! I hate when you don't remember these shit to the battle over, bro. It's fun. Ah, I was so caught up to fighting for guys. Let's check on that girl. Come on. I don't think she's breathing. Hey, we need help over here! This is a twist. It's supposed to be Priscilla who gets attacked. No, it's Yuffie. Maybe someone should go find a doctor? There's no time. Somebody! Help! How could she be cold already? Breathing again. Why did Hamilton again drop that fast? Maybe someone should go find a doctor? There's no time. <sighs> Don't just stand there, help me! You're on chest compressions. Got it. It was so weird when there was a mini game for this in the original game too. Yeah, start. <laughs> start. <laughs> God, you got lucky, bro. You picked the wrong girl, creep. What? Those guys there are from the Splinter Cell. Splinter Cell? They used to be with Avalanche, but left after a policy dispute. <sighs> Easy. They're guests of mine. And this one was trying to save your life. He was? Ugh, he's gone, da, da, Yuffie. Call the guy a creep, da, da, why don't you? Da, 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 da. The original knucklehead of ninja. Okay, Yuffie. Let's get you inside. You've had a rough day. Yeah. Alright. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> Not to beat that guy, but kids these days, I swear. Now, now. Who's that? Yuffie Kisaragi. Another one of my guests. I see my new best friend. The world's on fire. Yep. Yep. They did. <laughs> so, yeah, she's in the original, she showed up in a random encounter in the bush areas of Junon. But now oh, she. <laughs> Just throw something you know. Wait a minute! I saw that. I saw that. Where are you? No, no, no. A card player. Square up. Oh, well, would you look at that? I finally hooked a catch and a good one, too. Bet you thought you could blow me out of the water just because I'm getting on in years, hmm? Well, think again. I'm this town's ace angler. Zoka, Never said the words blowing me much together ever again. Fish than you, Sonny. I tell you that much. You youngins can thrash all you like, but you'll never beat my years of it. Thank you, speed up front. Yes, I can. Ah, oh, I should have put Shiva in. I wanted to see what it did. That was fine. Set the cards you want the mood again.
Wait a minute. Uh, it's ready to go. What can you do? It's not looking good. <laughs> it's not looking great. <laughs> Yeah, I pretty much lost this. Restart. Let's make a new deck. You want to put Shiva and Chuck a Bone in there? Do these soldiers. Cactor, Crystal, Ready for the zoo in? Yeah. Let's do one of these. Flan and one arch dragon. Let's use this deck.
I was afraid it was going to do that. It was me twat what to do. <laughs> Did I get no advantage? Doesn't matter what I play here, though. That's not true. We get Shiva somewhere we can win this. What a twat. I wish I could. He's got me on this one. God, man, fucking... Really, man? All fucking spaces? Whatever. Whatever, what a jackass. Go ahead and play something down to the bottom to block me. Yep. Yep, don't play anything, right? What an annoying little bastard. Just play. What an annoying bastard, bro. All you can fucking do is keep blocking me. Why can't I got something that goes around the side? Why? That's why. Got the moose out of manager in a second. Yep. Annoying little fuck, bro.
fucking asshole. Yeah, I got a fucking break, bro. Why the fuck can't Zoo be played once? Hmm? Jesus. That fucking hard to bring Zoo in once? That's all fine, like 900 fucking times. Not Zoo, Zoo not once. Oh, this is it right here. Thank Christ. Two of them. The great googly moogly. They took over the fucking board. Already lost. It feels like no matter what I fucking play, it loses. something on that bottom bar just to fuck with me. Fucking hurt. What a what an absolute dickhead. What an absolute dickhead bro. You can only hope he's not gonna fucking do it, but he's just going to do it. This is fucking ridiculous. I can't play anything because I did that. Good to know. Good to know. I wasn't sure how it worked, but okay.
fucking ridiculous. God forbid I got a fucking car if it goes one other way. God fucking forbid it. It's just nonsense, bro. Like, you mean a lot of losing? Talk about blah, blah blah blah. Cool. Goodness me, this is the one that got away. Serves me. I don't want to hear you. Fast forward on your own. Why the shit out of me? It was before Charlie was the old man. I just so tired of hearing this dude. Jesus Christ. He was playing like he was fucking money on the line. Ocean's real quiet today. Too quiet. Something oh my god, she died or runs. <laughs> hey, you guys are that avalanche splinter cell, right? Now, how the hell did you... I just gotta say, I'm a big, huge man of yours. HQ wishes they could be as cool as you guys. <sighs> well, uh... We are pretty cool, but... <laughs> think we could sit down for a chat later? Got a teensy favor to ask. And gotta thank you for before. Well, I suppose you could come by the inn tomorrow. So wait! You won't be sorry. Promise. Later! Yee. Get it, Yuffie. We get it, Yuffie. Um... I know, I know. She laid it on pretty thick. But hey, she's just a kid. What's the harm in hearing her out? Maybe she wants your autograph. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's get ourselves some rooms. Clap your autograph, Mr. Barrett. Hey, if he's in the heroes of the hour, That's I heard me. about what you did for that girl. That's right. Thank you so much. Your stay is on us. We insist. It's the least we can do for you, really. Now then, how many we got? Will four rooms be enough? Right? <laughs> five rooms. Uh, could you make it five? Five it is. 
Oh, everything is comped. Oh. So if you need anything at all, just ask. Don't know about you, but I'm dying to put my feet up. It's nice to have the place booked up again for once. Gosh, when was the last time that happened? How are y'all in business? They said he's like, a, we, it's been a while since we've been booked up, and I'm like, you see where they live, right? They're underneath the freaking Junon. How are they in business? <laughs> How much people come for? Here? It does look nice and cozy, though. It's open. Hey, so about that Yuffie kid, what do you think she wants with us? Be honest. To join Avalanche. Maybe she wants to join Avalanche. Normally, I wouldn't turn anyone away, but she's just too young. Don't have the time or patience to babysit. I'll break it to her gentle. I could feel them slipping away one by one, and the tighter I held on, the more I lost. I know. I felt the same. It was like Ooh. they were sucking them straight out of my head. Uh -huh. Hey, what's going on over here? missing someone else is talking to them. only that something is like it's on the tip of my tongue but i just can't remember damn whispers speaking of have you seen them lately <laughs> what's she talking to? Wow. Hello. who's in there with you oh hmm. right thought it was someone else Nope. All clear here, officer. Huh? Well, hope the rest of your patrol is just as uneventful. That was a red's voice. Hey, 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 open the door. I saw it on treasure chest. Come in. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. There with this lady. Racist attack, but not magic. There is this is Aerith, right? <laughs> Radiant Ward. Conjure Ward, but grants invincibility while casting spells. That sounds OP as shit. <laughs> she can be invincible the whole time? That's crazy. Uh, proficiency bonus. Finish off an enemy with a standard attack. Launch from within the ward. Okay. So I use physical attacks. Head set up. Good stuff. Sorry about that. Lightning damage up and endure ward. MP recovery. Switch max MP. And. New material I can put on her. What did I pick up from the dock? HP up, right? Yeah. But she already has one. Oh. She can have another. Oh, that's not over there. Okay. 
That'd be splendid. I don't know about you, but it feels like we've been on the road forever. Like Midgar's ancient history. I wonder how Mom and Marlene are holding up. I'm sick. Mm. No time for that, not with Sephiroth around. Mm. So, a little random, but do you remember the first time we met? You shoved a flower at me. You shoved a flower in my face. It's called a gift, Cloud. I saw it, you know, in a vase at Seventh Heaven. And I seriously doubt you're the one who put it there. Hey, I mean, you never know. <laughs> Some advice? Never re-gift a present from a girl. Especially if you're just gonna give it to another one. Damn. Water under the bridge. But next time... She's got a point. <laughs> that is kind of shitty. But he gave uh, Eros flower to Katifa. This one was this. He's like, never re-gift a, uh, never re-gift a gift you got from a girl to another girl. Still pretty soon. So, let's see. Ivor Red has been hiding his actual voice, or there was somebody else who were talking to him here. This town reeks of fish and brine. Should Shinra come calling, I doubt I'll smell them till it's too late. Don't worry. Never thought you could. <laughs> I'll leave it all to you then. <laughs> One person's missing. This Tifa. That must be her room there what's open. She's not there. Hmm, probably. Oh wait. This year, she's upstairs here. First door room. Oh! Oh! Hey! Hey! Perfect timing. I was just about to come find you. Uh huh. Yeah, I. You. Uh huh. Regret what I said in calm. Oh. Come in. Uh-huh. I should have never doubted you. It's fine. I never should have doubted you either. Say, do you remember a guy named Emilio from Nibelheim? Emilio? That was a trick. I can't pause! The only person right. from the village I remember is you. Huh? Oh. Okay then. His family owned the general store. Right. Anyway, he left the village right before you did. Thought I'd never see him again. Then one day last year, he shows up at Seventh Heaven. I couldn't believe my eyes. He was all... grown up. Didn't even recognize him at first. Really? Yeah, and what's more, the woman who walked in with him was stunning. Like, she could have been a model, and... <laughs> You're... not interested, are you? Those are two really. favorite words. But I I'm happy to listen, so go ahead. It's okay. Forget it. Fuck, man. Why he's ruining, man? Why he's talk, man? Shut up. <laughs> I hate him sometimes, you know. <laughs> Look. We... Go ahead. 
I I made the right choice to say he said something stupid. <laughs> she was uh, she was talking about the guy from their hometown. She was like, uh, "You're not interested, are you?" He's like, "Not really, but go ahead." <laughs> then she goes, "It's okay, forget it." <laughs> God damn it! Why you kill the buzz, bro? She just was happy to talk about somebody from the hometown, man. Why you gotta do that? <laughs> God damn it, Cloud. Was this another test? No, it wasn't. I. Oh my god, he's making a voice! Oh! Oh, I can't with this guy, bro. I can't with this guy, bro. Oh my god, Cloud, you are ruining everything, man. Okay. Why deny it? I guess it was, huh? I'm sorry. It's fine. We'll find time to talk. Just the two of us. Figure things out. Just be ready to spill your guts, huh? <laughs> With my iron stomach? <laughs> All right, and then on a happy note. All right, okay. Night. Yeah, for now, yeah. Probably. Bro, I felt so painful. Too bad of a little motel, you know. Very cozy. It was like a dialogue choice for her too, and if you choose incorrectly, she always steals something from you. But if you choose correctly, she joins you up at the party. And if you join up in Wu Tai, that's when she takes all your material. <laughs> kinda <laughs> I kind of hope she does it again. I kind of hope that she does do it again. Yes. For all have a I'll have some trouble remembering which material goes with who. Hmm. Isn't my imagination of some textures here kind of weird? Yeah. Something looks off. It's like it doesn't look like something's popped in yet. expected that <laughs> all right I'm banging on my door so hard so come on in guys huh hey Gang's all here. It's time you got to know me. My name is Yuffie, material hunter and elite ninja operative for the interim Wu Tai government. I left my How beloved homeland behind to bring an end to Shinra's reign of terror and prove that Wu Tai's not to be trifled with. Uh, Wu Tai. That was a neat trick. Yep. Yeah, Wu Tai. Which brings me to that little favor I mentioned yesterday. Wu Tai ain't nothing to fuck short, with. Wu Tai ain't nothing to fuck HQ, with. HQ, 
They just didn't understand. But you guys get it. <sighs> Don't ninjas creep around in the dark slitting people's throats? I mean, we've done some shit, but we ain't about to stoop that way. I resent that! Although, that is something we do. <laughs> Traveling alone so far from home is expensive. So I've been moving from town to town, hustling, scraping together enough scratch to keep sticking it to the man. Until, that is, I came here. And lucky I did, because I met Rhonda. She offered me the gig of a lifetime and a Fascination. Oh, who? guess who the target is? Say Rufus Shinra. Say it. Seriously, guess. <sighs> Just spit it out already. Who else? But a certain company's new yes. president. Yes. Rufus freaking Shinra. I am all for this. What? Kill Rufus Shinra. And that douchebag will be here any minute now. Up there here. I anyway. highly approve. Enjoying his fancy inauguration parade. These people had their country stolen from them, and then their sunlight. Junon demands revenge. So when the president steps out. Oh, wow. Tell us more. Mm -hmm. Okay. You want to know how Rhonda's planning on paying me? With your bounty suckers. What? Oh, gotta hand it to her. The lady works fast. Well, this is fun. See ya. Hey. <laughs> I know you're in there, my friend. I know who that is. I know who that is. <laughs> I was just talking about him the other day. If you manage to get away, you should try to find Priscilla. She'll get you topside. <laughs> the fucking soldier dude with the pompadour. You don't want to make I do it. <laughs> Uh, apparently he had to come back on the bounty. So I wanna know how much Cloud's bounty is. Barrett, Biggs, Wedge, Jesse, and T4 all for a hundred thousand apiece. Aerith is a five hundred thousand. Indeed. How much is Cloud? <laughs> but three feet. Wait a minute. Why don't I see something in here? Hmm. I was wondering I was gonna run into this dude again. Honestly, how long do you intend to keep my me eyes? Running? Absence certainly Look at makes the hair. heart grow fonder, my friend. <laughs> Still playing hard to get, it. Eh? It's like a pump well, it all bullet combo. For you, young man. As in my feet, <laughs> the speed demon has been entrusted with a singular task. Retrieving one Aerith Dane. Uh, me? You. You come alone? <laughs> It only takes two to tango. Nice. Besides, you and I like to go big, and a venue uh -huh. this small just won't do. But no need to worry. I found the perfect stage. The city above, where we can dance up a storm. Seek me out, and we'll put our last performance to shame. With a show none shall ever forget. <laughs> You got some weird friends, man. You're one of my friends, Baron. We might want to think about getting out of here. These people don't need more trouble. Yuffie said to talk to Priscilla if we wanted to get topside, right? Let's go find her. Thanks for dealing with that Shinra nut job. Don't you think for even a second we did that for you? The slime ball who sold us out. Take it. Not much, but it's yours. 
the hell is this supposed to be? 5,000 kill. <laughs> Your bounty. Part of it, anyway. You thought I'd put you through the ringer like that without making it worth your while? We're on the same side. Always have been. What if Biker Boy had taken us in? Then I would have had to improvise. But I didn't, because it all worked out. It worked out fine. Like I pray it will for you, Fee, upstairs. New quests are available in Junon region. New Queens Ball players await your challenge in the Crow's Nest. Fast travel is now available! Really? You have another job for me? What's up? <laughs> Didn't think you'd still be hanging around. Well, since you clearly don't have anything better to do, think I could put you to work? The remainder of your bounty. I need it delivered to someone. I've already got a porter picked out, too. This here is Salmon. Since he'll be the one making the drop, it's your job to get him there safe. Huh. Doesn't seem like too much of a hassle, but... Who exactly is this money for? My son. Haven't seen him in a spell. Not since he left town. And never looked back. This gills me washing my hands of him. He's a grown man. Can't be clinging to his mom's skirts. Or her pocketbook. Hmm. Where is he? The crow's nest. Boy got sick of living under this steel sky. And my thumb, I suppose. So he went into the mountains way east of here. Found some more like-minded idiots. Kinda sad, if I'm being honest. If you're gonna run away, at least go somewhere interesting. Don't half-ass it. I meant what I said. Can't afford to take care of this town and his shit. I raised him best I could. Gave him every advantage. But he's gotta learn to stand on his own two feet. Besides, I've got someone else to take care of now. Don't I, Sam? Huh. Much obliged. Once you make it to the crow's nest, find Toby. He'll make sure you get the reward I promised. But if I find a single hair out of place on Sam, you won't live to enjoy it. You keep my boy safe. Salmon headed for the village entrance. Oh, my eyes. Jesus. Quiet. Frog gully. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. Alright. Psycho. Two bees. Hey, Psycho. The job sounds riveting. <laughs> Jesus Lord, bro. This morning light. Oh, my eyes. <laughs> Game designers, please, my eyes. <laughs> Apparently, bro, Jesus. <laughs> is this HCR or something? Why is it so freaking bright? <laughs> I am. Wow. That reminds me. Uh, Seth Cloud is party leader. 
Now let's change red for Tifa. Shit, but we need error for a new ability. There's a weird mix. Hey, Cloud, remind me. How old were you when you left home? 14. Wait, it was spring, so 13. Suppose that ain't too unusual for small. Hold on. Hold on a minute. He was 13 when you left home. The deep volume incident was. Five years ago. He's 21 now. So he's 16 when it happened. Oh my god. The music that's playing, it's a stamp song. It's like a pop version of it. Uh, okay, so he left when he was 13, going on 14. Two or so years later, he goes back to Nibelheim as an infantryman. Because he was embarrassed he never made it a soldier. But you served for two years. Of course he's not going to be a soldier in two years. Yeah, no way. It took, it took Zach like seven or eight years to make it a soldier. And he was a second class. And the reason he got the first is because his teacher fucking went at you all. Oh, uh, Angelo. No, no. I mean, he's a uh, clone, yeah. He's like an experiment like Genesis, yeah. Oh, two different people. Now, boys like you, what'd your mom have to say? Not much. Didn't try to stop me. Like you said, nothing unusual about it. But. 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 2,000 gil. She offered me that. To make a fresh start. <laughs> Guess moms are the same all over. I turned the money down though. Didn't need it, since I was planning to enlist straight away. <laughs> but you still can't help setting your price to two grand. Sentimental, ain't you? Sorry, doggo. We just have a we just have a I'm on my line. <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah, you hit both of them with the bravery. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> I didn't think I was gonna catch both of them. <laughs> Where'd the dog go? Oh. Where'd the dog go? You know, just reminds me. Tony's gonna love this. <laughs> oh, this little damn dog. Where'd the dog do? <laughs> Come on! Have more conversations. I want to hear more about, about y'all things. Please. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> bitch here to represent. Combat settings, Chrono Aegis. I'm not a fan of that. Jetstream will bring them towards me. 
Yeah, let's use that next time. Let's set up the Radiant Ward. Source of Storm is pretty good. Let's change that one to Chrono Aegis. We'll keep on soldiering. Okay, hear me out. Yay, more what? conversation. Know how some parents stop the kids from leaving the nest, claiming it's too soon or they're not ready. Any excuse to keep them at home. What about it? Loads of parents are like that, but I told myself I'd be different. I'd never keep my little girl from flying. I don't want to clip her wings. I want her to soar. <laughs> I hear you scoffing. You think I can't do it? You think I'll keep her all to myself? Oh, yeah. <laughs> and that's what scares me. As much as I want to let her fly, I don't know if I'll be able to let go when the time comes. Maybe I'll panic, get in the way, hold her down. All to keep us safe. Oh, Marley. I wish you could be my baby girl forever. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking love the conversations between you. <laughs> parents like, uh, parents like, I'm not gonna be like one of those parents, but keeps their, keeps their little, uh, little baby from flying. As soon as the time comes, I'm gonna let her soar. And the class like, <laughs> <laughs> but it's like, I heard you scoffing. You don't think I'm gonna do it, huh? You think I'm just gonna keep my baby at home and make it an excuse to stop her from leaving the nest? And he's like, yep. <laughs> Hell yes. <laughs> oh, God. That was precious. <laughs> Here it comes, Take him down. Right. Get your ass out of here. Oh, I have to choose for the cast reading ward on. Let's go. That'll do. Sorry about that. Oh, I gotta go for it now. Very nice. Oh my god, I even noticed the bottom music is a staff song on fucking. Oh, some kind of fucking techno transmix. Bro, I need an MP3 player kind of thing so I can have these songs play or whatever. What they have in the Final Fantasy 15? It was an FF15. That's all I need. Still do soldiering when they have that award up. So first we do some radiant war, then we can do soldiering right after it.
you silly daddy. He's gonna, he's gonna fail you. Oh, I can't let you go. I just can't. Garrett, get your shit together. That means barely out of diapers. You've got time. Right, right. I'm just getting worked up over nothing. Yeah. She won't be leaving me for a while. Hey. Oh, the conversations are great. <laughs> the parents like, my sweet baby girl, how can I let you go? Cops like get your shit together. <laughs> She's not even out of time for shit. <laughs> you got time. <laughs> oh my lord. See, I need more of these people talking and less of the other ones talking. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Charlie and female Charlie. I need them both to just fuck out of here. <laughs> Oh, I know he warmed up that phone to call me. I know it's coming. Back. What the hell is that? Oh, the music! <laughs> sandstorm! They do a techno and they did a sandstorm! <laughs> Hold on, what was that? You have been petrified. Taking a certain amount of damage while the state will turn you to stone, rendering you incapacitated. Avoid damage until the status wears off, or a cube ailment with a Suna, remedies, or other spells, or other item effects. <laughs> Boy, he really lays one for me, too. That's good, right. Okay. Attack can be aura shrouds, it will produce tornadoes. The aura will weaken with each tornado spawn. And once it has vanished, the Drake will become pressured. Attacking him will, from behind will weaken the aura without creating tornadoes. Jeez, they are on my ass. Keep it together. I'm coming. You'll see. Here. Ah! Get him! Ah! 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 One more bar. Don't overdo it. Here goes. Uh, Lend me your strength. Someone looks kind of shaky. It's your turn. Hang back. Take the lead. Oh, I got this. Ready, Earth? Let's fucking do it. Here he comes. Pretty. That was pretty. <laughs> also, petrify, but I can't even get soft yet. Wait a minute. Hold on. I think I do have soft. No, I don't. I have a smelling salts. That's what I have. Back on this. That's celibus this whole time. Probably could make some. I don't know, the doge got hit. He's moving so fast, I can't even heal him. Now, he only got nicked a little. He's hit. Sam! 
What are you doing here? <laughs> Came all this way and you're still full of energy. Uh, do I know you? You're about to. We're Sam's bodyguards. Your mom hired us to keep him safe. And to make sure her boy got his allowance. Keep it. I ain't taking her money. I can make ends meet on my own. Who are they, Dylan? Friends of yours? Claire! Well, it's not expected that. You know you need to stay off your feet. I know you came all this way, but I can't accept that. Just make sure Sam gets home safe for me. You really are your mother's kid. Got her stubbornness and everything. Have it your way. Why don't you hang on to it? This is a fortune. If you really don't want it, I'll take it off your hands. But as a parent, I'm sure you want to give your kid the best life you can. And in my experience, that don't come cheap. Think it over. That's wise words. We'll take it. Dilster was looking for you, dude. Toby. Sorry, got a little tied up. Hang on. You are too guys white to be called Toby. Honda said I might run into you. Avalanche? Wait, you mean they're the ones who blew up those reactors? The superstars themselves. I just want to say it is such an honor to meet you. Actually, while you're here, think I could ask you for a favor? Seeing as Dylan's uh, situation seems to be taken care of? Yeah, it's all good. Excellent. In that case, why don't we step into my office for a chat? Right this way. You think my mom knew about me and Claire and the baby? I'm happy we were able to meet you. Almost feels like this little one brought us together. Crows against Shinra welcomes all those who believe you in Karinos freedom. You are something else. When I saw you on the news, I was blown away. Did you say Midgarinos? And here you are, lending me a hand. It's literally a dream come true. What's up with the fact when you said Midgarinos? So, here's the situation. There's this big lighthouse down by the Cape, and someone calling themselves the Merc of Junon has turned it into their hideout or something. Curious. Oh, God. Oh, are they an acquaintance of yours? Sorta. What are the chance? Say again. I don't know about you, but I think fate brought us together. Anyway, that place has got a killer view. We used to go up there all the time and just chill. But it's too dangerous with all the monsters around, and that merc hasn't done a thing about him. So I was hoping you could do me a solid and convince that merc to help us out. That's weird. Yo, you're the best! You know, I just knew I could count on you. Uh, check the app on your phone. So? You gonna help, or... Me? You can sniff out trouble. <laughs> I suppose that does make me the most suitable candidate. Oh, pro tip! If you ever get the chance, you ought to swing by the hill, too. You might even catch... Oh my god. I just noticed something. Will you change Red's weapon and changes his collar? A glimpse of the Great Condor if you're lucky. If you're into that kind of stuff. Because I remember it was originally headdresses as well as his weapon, but I guess now it's collars. I can actually see the material I wanted to. I can just get in here. Come on. Jesus, man. I need to get the better for the red. I need you not to move. Sorry, kitty. Oh my god.
I saw during the cutscene. But yeah, I can see the material in his weapon. I can see the mine and Barrett's as well. And I saw the Tifa's glove. I get that we're brand new to the scene. here just to see the famous Queen's Blood rocker. All right, twist my arm, why don't you? I'll give you the show of a lifetime. I'm good. Oof, savage. So you're not a talent <laughs> scout or a fan. Why didn't you say something? The name's Neil, and I'm going to be the world's greatest QB playing guitarist. What do you say? Want to play against a future celebrity? Bring it. I think we should make another deck or a fix up one. Uh, fix up this one. How much should we get rid of? This. Why is this backwards? Let's try this. <laughs> oh, see me get screwed over again. Myself over that one. Huh. God damn weird. Really much got me. Alright, restart.
Jesus. I just destroyed three cards. This is nuts. Damn it, they got me again. <clears throat> Just gonna understand my cards better. Yep, screw me on that one too. Right. What is my issue here? <laughs> new deck again? Let's make a new one again. a power by light like cards on affected tiles by three while this card is in play. Yeah, let me do two of those.
God, he always plays this fucking crowd first every fucking time. Jesus Christ. Fucking repeat offender over here. up the right card for every fucking situation. All this dude do is box me in, bruv. Fine.
Fox hunting on a handed ship. He does it so easily. Without fucking fail. No matter what the fuck I start with. That's right, he finally gets a star with that stupid fucking card. Look at this shit. How's this fucking fair? What an absolute dickhead, bro. What an absolute dickhead. I'm getting fucking mad. I knew it was gonna make me mad eventually. I knew he was gonna do some d dumb shit. players on top to block me early. Fucking call it. It don't fucking matter what I'm gonna do fucking do. He's just gonna have a fucking counter for it every fucking time. Then play on top again to block me from going further. Correct. Then play on the fucking bottom level to stop me from going even further. Correct. It does not fucking matter. This is a shit match. Hey, don't beat yourself up over. Go fuck yourself, bro. Shit match. Lucky. We're gonna reclaim these waters and make them beautiful again. Every fucking time I do something, he goes up there and block me over. The fucking problem is, I'm playing first. If I can play second, I can get the advantage. What a piece of shit. Oh look, another, another fucking pack. Cool, we'll see what that does. Fucking bitch. Stop talking. You got me fucking mad, bro. Let me see over there. I'm gonna tired of this monitor going to sleep. I'm gonna tired of it. Just turn it off. There you go. Uh, races a power of allied and enemy cards affected by tiles of one when this card is in play. Why would I want to raise the power of my enemy's cards? 
Power Rider. Maybe. This looks good. Bet I'll never get the fucking play it. When playing, lower the power of enemy cards affected on tiles, fight three. Cool. But I'll never get a chance to play it because I had a fucking weird screw in the knee to play it there. Cool. It's not gonna fucking work. Anything else you got? When played, lower the power of allied and enemy cards on affected tiles by three. That actually sounds useful. Take two of them. Two of these. Uh, two Mandrogo, two Wolves. I don't, I don't understand why y'all giving me, giving me spaces to advance behind me. I want to advance in front of me. What's the fucking point of, whatever. Fucking stupid ass. Stupid fucking game. Begin match so I can lose again. Let's go. One time I get in here, so the card I can't even fucking play to take advantage. So one time I got in here. That's good. But if I play this, there's no reason for it. So we have more power. That's it. I can't advance. In other words, this is dead. Keep fucking with me. Give me a new ass. Now that I don't have a car back account at the bottom, he's gonna play on the bottom, right? Still gonna play in the middle? Okay. Later, I'm gonna make sense of playing something to me.
Did I get everything I fucking could? We got like five spaces for work, so you can do it
find a freaking way. <sighs> Christ. What an annoying little bitch. It's all out on a card game, bro. What an annoying little bitch. When destroyed, the level of power of allied and enemy cards on the front of Thales by three. That's such a stupid card, dog. God damn, dude! Holy shit, wipe the floor with me! Then again, I can count on one hand the times I've won. I might actually. An upbeat melody's coming. I knew. Oh, I can. One of these days, Stop there's nothing to keep strumming the guitar and playing cards. Claire's really lucky. Talk about a love story for the ages. She was born here. She? Well, you think it's totally All right, coming for you, say. Oh my god. All right, there's two more people to be in the card game. God damn it. <laughs> Look at our ocean. Look at it. Look at it! I want you all to look at it. Alright. What? Where, where are you? Where are you? Right here. I, I, I don't have to do me, bro. <laughs> I can't. This, this, is another, this is another time. Let me go, let me go kill things. I need to feel better. I'm in the stream. Can't I can't do it.